Nigel Chambers here from Big Go Belt Media, Gaten, Tony, and Marseille. Very excited to talk to you three today about the new series, Lego Star Wars Rebuild the Galaxy, coming to Disney Plus September 13th. How are you all doing today? Good. Thanks, Nigel. How are you? I am well. I am well. Um, I've started off my other interviews today on the same note, and I would like to do the same with you all. And then unfortunate news, we just lost the legend with the passing of James Earl Jones. I would love for you, you all to be able to share a word or two about either your fandom, his legacy, his impact, and you all's careers and lives. lives. I mean, uh, one, the, the, the memory that will always stay in my head is, you know, is, is Mufasa. You know, I mm -hmm. watched yeah. As a kid, I watched that movie at at the very, very least over 500 times. Mm -hmm. And he was, you know, he was he was the father I wanted, you know, a big, strong lion who would protect his cub no matter what. And, you know, his voice just emulated that. And, and everything I've heard about the person only adds to that. And so it's a it's a loss for sure. But, you know. Uh, at 93, I hope, and I'm pretty sure he lived in a wonderful life, and hopefully it was, it was an easy passing. Mm. Yeah, he's, he's just absolutely, like, it's one of those actors to truly become legendary in every aspect of the craft in any context that he decided to take, uh, to step into. He more than thrived. He became someone who everybody wanted to emulate, who you could look, whether it was voiceover, whether it was on screen, whether it was on stage, um, as somebody who loves the theater greatly, uh, he's an absolute beyond. It's he's one who the legends look up to, and it's wonderful that he had such an incredible career and an incredible life, and um, an incredibly long one too. It's always just such a blessing, and to grow up loving his work uh, is amazing, and to grow up uh, hearing so many amazing stories of him as a person from people that I work with who know him well. Uh, it is just an honor to have been alive at the same time he he was, yeah. and uh, yeah, just the best to his family and his friends because it's horrible, even when someone had a very long, uh, yeah. amazing life. Um, my condolences to the to his family, mm -hmm. his friends, closely, and I believe everyone that has like looked up to him. I feel like when you think of a legacy and longevity and strength of, of black excellence you think of james earl jones and um like gayton was saying like working with other actors that were blessed enough to be in his presence and have worked and seen his craft in person is something that um you know us as actors we don't take lightly mm -hmm. and i i believe that you know, he, he was a king in everything that he <laughs> appeared in, you know, and you, you will always remember his strength, his voice, the, um, like every, like literally almost probably mainly a lot of scripts think of him with certain characters. It's like, think of James Earl Jones and you immediately understand the character and the empathy that that yeah. character is supposed to have. So, um, may he rest in peace. Mm -hmm. Is may everybody around him feel comfort and yeah. love throughout this time, and we will always remember him as the king that he was. That's so beautiful. Thank you, you three. Uh, let me get a Thank last you. question in here about this series, the four piece, as they call it, and I was calling it before I even saw that tagline. Now, my my very simple and uh, final question for you all is the cornerstone. If you three had a chance to hold it, what would be something important you would think of to activate it? And we'll come back to you. We'll start with you, Marcel. No, oh, don't start with me. I'm trying to think. <laughs> <laughs> well, fair game. Fair game, everyone. <laughs> I don't have an answer to that question. If, if 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 I'm holding the cornerstone and I want to add something in, like say it gave me the power to control Lucasfilm for two seconds and and green light a movie. Let's let's look at it that way. <laughs> sure. Give I I very want, specific. I want a, I want a Darth <laughs> Revan movie. I want a Darth Revan movie. I don't know who would play it, but I want Dude, it. We need a Darth Revan movie. I know, Dude. right? Uh, like, I'm looking at it that way. I'm looking at it that way. I want him in the universe. I want him. Mm -hmm. And you know what? Like, you know, I, I want it to be played by Gaten. I'm saying it here now. Oh, 
I think that That's Darth Revan is certainly a, a five foot five. <laughs> yes. Uh, like this is, yeah, I think that'd be so funny if we find out Darth Revan, one of the more formidable Jedi turned Sith and vice versa people ends up being Dustin from Stranger Things. <laughs> I think it would be great, but only, only if I get to voice you when you're in the helmet. <laughs> Like, I get to be Pedro Pascal, but you do. <laughs> You're not the boy. This is a great pitch, guys. This is good. Oh, this Keep, it going. Keep it going. Mm -hmm. What are you adding to this? <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I'm like, like there's nothing to add. Leave it to the guys to know exactly what to do. I'm just yeah. there. Like, let me. Who knows? Yeah, my input. Yeah, yeah. Who knows? Who knows? I'll, I'll appear somewhere in the mm. background. <laughs> okay, well, we'll 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 leave it at that. I got I one. If I could, if I could get the power to do anything, I would make ice cream taste the same, but be calorie free. Whoa! <laughs> oh. Bless your heart. <laughs> oh. bless your heart. Bless your heart. <laughs> that was a good one. Though. We wanted something you, there. You just made uh, one piece. <laughs> We're, we're, we're truly thank you three so much for your time um the, the, the great verse in the beginning of this i honestly would love to see you three in some collaborative effort in live action that would be amazing <laughs> Likewise, you can see the banter go. here now but in the meantime folks get to check out lego star wars rebuild the galaxy streaming on disney plus september 13th it's been a pleasure everyone thanks so much Najir. appreciate it absolutely Bye.